Hi there. Today I'll be showing you how to manage questions asked at booking. When customers book appointments online, they'll be asked questions such as name and email. You can manage those questions and also add custom ones to get the answers that you need. Under Data Capture, you can set up your questions to be asked at booking. You can also pick if the phone number should be required or optional. Here, you can choose if the reply is a simple yes, no or text. And here, you can add new questions. On Consent and Opt-in, the consent to contact cannot be removed or edited. This is so that we can have permission to use your customer's details to make the booking and to send them reminders. You can add a new question here. Once you set it live, it cannot be edited, only deleted and replaced with something slightly different. And all answers will be stored. This is what your customers will see. Your customers will pick the service they want to book, the time slot, and then they'll be asked to submit their details. This is also where they will answer the questions that you've set up. Your customers will fill in their name, email, phone number, and a text answer for the question. For the yes, no question, you have a tick box that you can use. Ticked obviously means yes, and unticked, no. And lastly, you have the opt-in questions. Those are required at booking so the customer has to agree to them in order to complete their booking. Now that the appointment is booked, you probably wonder where the answers are recorded. You can find them on the appointment at the top of the activity window. For the opt-in questions, those are recorded against the customer on the customer record. For this, we also record the last time that the consent has been given or revoked, so the last response. We're available at help at if you need us. Bye now.